Why did I just zest eight lemons, chop up a load of garlic, get a huge amount of rosemary and fresh sage? I wanted to make one of the best seasonings I have ever come across. And I cannot believe I've got to the age of 42 without realizing this exists. This stuff is amazing. It's perfect for the holiday for Christmas. You gotta check it out, guys. Let's show you how to make it. Let's go. All you need is fresh sage, rosemary, zest of lemon, garlic, and kosher salt. That is it, simple as that. Let's get to it, let's go. All you've got to do is just pick the leaves off of the sage. We're gonna go for about a cup of each herb. I mean, you can have this on anything. You could season your steaks with it. You could do, if you're doing a stew, add it to your stew. You know, it's endless. Turkey for Christmas dinner, whatever meat you're cooking up for Christmas, just season it with this stuff. And I'm telling you, you'll be like, oh my, how did I not know about this? And you can put it in your fridge, put it in a silk container like this, put it in your fridge and it'll last months. For optimum freshness, use it up within about two or three weeks, but it will last four months. If you've never stripped these before, all you gotta do is get to the top, literally just pull down, take the top off and that's it, you're done. Strips, so easy to do. And it's so aromatic. It's like, if you're gonna make a perfume that says Christmas, this stuff smells exactly of that. Okay, so you wanna be adding three cloves of garlic. I've chopped the ends off them. You really don't wanna be adding extra garlic to this because it's a dry mix and you, you don't want it to be wet, you want the salt to stay dry, just stick to three cloves. Everyone loves garlic, I love garlic, but this is part of the ingredients and you don't want to add. It'll just make it moist and you don't want it moist. We don't want it moist. To get the salt, kosher salt is best for this. Uh, so now you've cleared up your salt spillage, we've got a cup of salt, as I say, so we'll add that. Then we've pretty much got a cup of each. Add that, add your three cloves of garlic. Zest of lemon, so what we're gonna do is just one whole zest of lemon. Keep your thumb on the lemon. By holding your thumb on the lemon, it just makes it easier to maneuver that around. I mean, you can do that, but you get less wastage this way. I mean, look at that. Is that not spot on? Right, let's go. Lid on, it's always best to pulse first. and then blend for about a minute. Every time you open this up, you're just gonna be like, ah. Oh. It smells so good. I mean, so good. You can use this stuff all year round. It's so simple to do. It's that good. I'm making up a load of batches and I'm giving it away as Christmas gifts. That tells you something. Great little personal gift that you can give to your friends and family. They're gonna be like, oh my. Put it on roast potatoes. Imagine that. Root vegetables, amazing. Just gotta get it done. Get you some, guys. Honestly. <laughs> it's amazing. It smells so good. It tastes even better. And that's why I've made a massive batch. I'm gonna gift the load out for Christmas. It's a perfect thing to give away to friends and family for a little Christmas treat. Homemade, tastes awesome. Hope you liked the video, guys. Please remember to like and subscribe. It doesn't cost a penny to subscribe. It helps the channel out massively. You just can't go wrong, especially with this stuff. Cheers, I'll see you when I see you.